Watch the entire video my lovely viewers, I mean from start to finish, to get the whole thing. Without wasting much of your time, let's get right into it. Hi lovely viewers, it's me again, your one and only Mtati Mpundu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel by hitting the red subscribe button down below and turn the bell icon to join the notification squad. Don't forget to like, share and leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you lovely viewers. If you are a president, everyone will pretend to love you. When Edi Galungu was in power, Bom and Lusambo, the wife gave birth to twin. One of them he said he said Diga. One of them he said he's Stella. Where is Bom and Lusambo and Edi Galungu today? Fake love. Fake love. Betrayer. Betrayer. The reason why I, I, I don't respond to uh, I don't respond to people like Simon or these other idiots that are talking. See, I want, see, I want. No, no, no. I don't have time for those. Those are young children. Those are young babies. They don't know anything. But the reason why I'm using this to tell the leadership of UPND to say your downfall is at hand. The people that you have embraced now thinking that they love you, they don't love you. There are people that sacrifice their lives for you. There are people that lost businesses for you. Those days when you support UPND, you are, you, you are like an outcast. Simon, let me ask you a question. You said you are born again. You love Jesus. I am a false prophet. I've shown you a false prophet stood with HH when HH was in prison. Where were you when HH was in prison? You were dancing with the PF. You were campaigning for PF. When PF cadres were killing and destroying, when you wear UPND regalia, you come out. I didn't, I didn't see you detach yourself from them. You were still campaigning for them. Mao Sampa was your best friend when he was in PF. When they were in power. You were always going to his house with your camera. Oh, my brother. Oh, my brother. What has changed? Kelvin Sampa was your best friend. Chilando was your best friend. All the PF criminals, they were your best friend. Did you tell them to stop killing people? Did you tell them to remove HH from prison? Show me where you campaigned for HH. You said you were doing an advert that if they pay you, you, you advertise for them. So are you telling me that it is good if a Satan must come and give you money to do an advert for him? Are you telling me you do it? You say you knew that PF was a bad organization. You said you knew that PF was killing people. PF was stuck. You called them notorious PF. You, know, you knew that they were notorious, but you were advertising for them. From the deep down your heart, is this the character of a believer? So what if, because you, you, you have a page, though a page that is not doing well. That's what you PND leaders are not realizing. You, who is, who listen to, who listen to Simon? Simon? What influence does he have? Now, okay, you say that you have, uh, you say that you have, um, they we are paying you for advert. So a criminal, notorious people can come and pay you for advice and you advertise for them. What if they won the election in 2021? So you mean that they were notoriously going to, you wanted them to continue ruling. A good business person, a good child of God. When you bring a business for him. And he knows that this business is going to affect people's life negatively. He will reject it. Personally to me, let me show you something. 
as I began to fight PF. This was July 2022. And this was Mast newspaper. This is a credible newspaper. The government of the Republic of Zambia, government of Lungu, approached the Nigerian government. Okay. Let me, uh, let me, I'll come back to this one. Okay. Let me go to the, the other one. This is Lusaka time. The government of the Republic of Zambia approached the Nigerian government to stop me from campaigning for a church, to stop me from speaking for the marginalized in Zambia, to stop me from fighting the PF. Nigeria High Commission to Zambia assures PF they will address C1 concern. The Nigerian High Commission in Zambia contacted the federal government and the federal government told me to stop fighting PF. Did I stop? This was 2020. I did my campaign until the last day of election. In fact, that day election was taking place. I was still campaigning for a church. I didn't res I I disrespected my government. I said no. I disrespected my government because my conscience told me that PF was not doing the right thing. PF was killing people. PF was destroying property. PF was mistreating a church. I didn't listen to my government because my conscience would not allow me to watch people suffer. My, my conscience would not allow me to see a church die in prison because had they had had the pf won election a church was going to be dead by now in prison because i knew all the plan why we we are fighting for all this thing you we are dancing with the pf today those of us that fought the battle we are bitter now you are the right person right eh? so they paid you for you to advertise their agenda. You wanted them to continue ruling. Eh? You were sharing. You knew that they were lying on their campaign messages. But you were giving them platform to lie to the people. What did you expect? If UPND was a serious government, people like you would never be anywhere close to the president. Because you are a Judas Iscariot. You can betray because of money. I didn't betray the people of Zambia. Even when my federal government intervened, I stood and fought. But you betrayed them. I don't know how much you said PF paid you. Maybe PF paid you... Uh, I don't know how much PF paid you. But because of that thing they paid you, you betrayed. Now that you see that they won, they lost the election, you have now come, you are pretending like you love HH. HH, wake up. Simon is a traitor. If you lose the election in 2026, he will move. The, he, he was, now he's calling PF notorious. He's calling Eddie Galungo all sorts of names. But he's the one who was in forefront. He go, ah! He go, ah! He go, ah! Hey! <laughs> see, to me, I'm not bothering. I don't even have problem. I'm still a young boy. I'm in my 30s. I still have a long way to go. If I don't eat in UPND government, another government will come. I will eat. So long as I work, so long as I work, I must eat. This is DJ Mutati exclusive. All right, that's all right for you today, lovely viewers. If you did enjoy the video, please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below. Tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you, lovely viewers. Once again, I go by the name of Mutatim Pondum. I love you. Peace. I gotta go.